guys, my name is Brittany and thank you for coming to Yoga Fever's page. This is your 30 minute bar workout um, focusing on the booty today. So what you're going to need, a resistance band if you have one at home. You'll also need a mat when we do groundwork. Um, and then you'll also need either a chair, a wall, or a bar if it is available for you. So where we're going to start is our standing warm up. We're going to come to a nice squat, feet are hip width distance apart. We're going to squat down reach up, down, and up. So leaning back into the heels, the arms come into it. We have that nice full range of motion throughout the entire body. We come down and up, toes are light. And we're gonna start to find a nice C curve through the back and arms and reach. So round like a beach ball, lift up. Round, releve, toes, round and toes. Good. So thinking nice and tall, Trying not to lose our balance. We got four, three, two, one. Shake it up. From right here, our arms are gonna come up. Our left leg, or right leg rather, is gonna come back, bend into that left leg. We pull in and out. If this is too much, just lunging in and out. Hands to hips to modify. In and out. Good, grounding down through that supported leg. The left knee stays strong. Four, three, toes are light. Two, arms reach up. We pull in, extend, in, extend. So elbows to that knee. We think long. Four, three, two, one. Good, hold it here. Arms stay reaching. Again, or modify, lift that back leg. Pulse up, 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 up. Woo, find your balance. Again, it's okay to wobble. Lift, lift, lift. Again, we're focusing on the booty. So we wanna make sure the glute medius is fully engaged and our hips are squared down. Four, three, two, one. Circle back, eight seconds. Six. Four, two, one. Bring it in and swap it out. So that left leg comes behind. Bend into that right leg. Bring it in and reach back. In and reach. To help us find stability, that navel comes to spine. We pull the ribs in and we take it nice and slow. Tap, pull in. Tap, pull in. Four, three, Arms extend to two, reach them out, pull in, out, in. Staying strong and sturdy, four, three, two, one. Reach those arms back, lift that back leg, hands to hip if you like, pulse, up, 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 three, two, one. Circle out. Good. Gives us time for balance. We'll use the bar in just a second. Three, two, one. Shake it all up. So we're going to come over to the bar. We're not going to use our resistance band just yet, but over here at the bar, we're going to start with a nice little chair. So hands are on the bar. We're about elbow width or forearm width apart from the bar or your chair or your wall. All we're going to do, feet or hip width distance, sink back. If you have an anchored bar, feel free to lean back. If you have a chair, please do not lean back, stay safe. Stand up and come down. This is all we're doing. Leaning back, squatting into the heel, squeezing the glutes at the top, seeing how low we can go. We got four, three, relevate onto the toes, two, one, lift up. Lower down, shoulders stay relaxed. Lower, up, lower, releve, high, lower, four, three. Right leg's gonna get some action. Two, one, right here, squat down. Lift that right leg back, squat, lift, squat, lift. So it's just a little lift, engaging through that glute medius. Lifting that leg straight back, not arc.
arch in the back. We got four, three, two, one. Bring that leg in, bending that left leg, tap the toes back, pull it in, tapping the ankle with your toe. Tap, pull in. Core is nice and tight, just as nice and tall. Shoulders are back. Four, three, two. Leave that leg back. Lift up and down. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Leave that leg lifted. One little pause. Up, up, up. You got this. Starting to really feel that burn in the back leg. Three, two. Leave that leg up. Circle it out. Circle. Keep it slow. Soften those shoulders. For three, you got it. For two, one, pull it back in. So the knees are gonna connect together. Soft bend in that left leg. Flex that right foot back and squeeze it towards your booty. We're gonna press that leg straight back and snap it back in. So that leg pushes back and we snap it back in. So we're not arching and pulling back. Get it controlled back, pull in, out, in. So find these singles. Finding that tempo, relax the hands, it's out, snap back, out, snap back. Finding doubles, it's out, out, snap back, out, out, snap back. Four, squeeze, two, squeeze, last one. Now finding lunges in a combo, pulse out, out, Lunge and come down. Squeeze it back in. Pulse out for two. Lunge down. Squeeze it in. Out, out, lunge and squeeze. Out, out, lunge and squeeze. Four. Squeeze in. Three. Squeeze in. Two. Oh, we're almost there. Squeeze in. One. Hold here for a second. So we focus on the glute medius. We're gonna focus on the glute, or we focus on glute max. Let's take it to glute knee. So standing up, let's bring the feet to first position. So that nice little V with the feet, toes turn out. Facing towards the bar, the feet are in a V. Your right leg's gonna to come to a 45. Soft bend in that left leg, flex that right foot back. All we're gonna do, lift and lower. Soft through the shoulders, lift, lower. So taking this nice and slow, catching your breath if you're like me. Four, three, two, one. Take doubles, down for two, up for two, and down. So up for two, down for one, that sounds right, up for two, down, two, down, and start to feel those shakes. We got four, three, two, keep reaching through that heel, one, pull it back in. Yeah, let's flip that left toe under, take a moment, flexing into that foot, and then we're gonna take the other side. You guys ready for that? So once again, we're gonna come onto, or into our chair, rather, feet are wide. We're gonna do the exact same thing here. So sitting back, lean back, releve. Coming right into it, flushing out the legs. Let's do eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Left leg lifts, one, squat down, lift back. Down, down. Keeping knees over ankles and weight in the toes. Again, not arching back, but keeping control. Four, three, two, one. Keep that leg back, pull it in, extend. In, toes to the ankle, extend. In, keep going, staying nice and tall. 
Again, if this is challenging, slow it down. Four, three, two, one. Keep that leg back. Lift up, up. Hips are still square towards that mirror. Up, up. Four, three, two, one. Circle out, out. You got this. Four, three, two. You got it. One. Lift that leg up. And then we're going to lunge down. So right here, lunging down. Moving forward, lift that leg. Lunge, lift, lunge, lift. Bringing just a little weight on that left foot. Four, three, two. Stay in that lunge. Sink down. Hold right here for three. Hold for two. One. Pull it all the way back in. That left knee knocks together with the right. Soft bend in that right leg. Squeeze that heel in. Flex that foot back. Knees are level with each other. Right here, we bring it back and snap in. Back, in, back. Find your tempo. Find your breath. Back and in. Four, three. We got doubles coming up. One. Bring it out, out, snap back. Woo! Out, out, snap back. Four, three. Squeeze. Two. Squeeze. One. Bring it down for that lunge. Good. So from our lunge, we squeeze in. Back for two. Lunge. Snap back. Out, out. Lunge, snap back, out, out, lunge, snap back, make it a little wider, out, out, big step, back and in, out, let's do three more, two, last one, hold for four, three, for two, you got this, one, bring it back to first position, so toes turn out once again, grounding down through that right leg, Left leg comes out to our 45. Soft bend in that left leg. Flex through left toes back. Lift up. Tap down. Keep reaching through that heel. Think of long lines lengthening. Coming into that glute knee. That outside muscle on that left booty. Four. Three. Two. Keep it up. One. Pulse up. 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 Last four. Three. Two, one, bring it all the way back in. We're gonna flip that right foot under. Give yourself a break. Nice work, guys. We're gonna move on. Woo, all right. So giving yourself just a moment. Again, towel off or grab some water if you need to. We're gonna do something that is kind of like flat work in the sense that we're gonna move directions. So we're gonna face towards our bar, soft bend in the left, Toes gonna come to a nice solid point. So pointing as hard as you possibly can. Point forward, tap that heel, out. Tap heel, bring it back, in. So forward, tap out, tap back, bring it forward. That's all we're doing. Back, tap, forward, tap, out. Tap, back, sink a little lower, tap, Squeeze that left knee in, your base left. Allow yourself to lean into that heel, not to grip through the toes. Let's do three more. Three. Long through the toes. Two. Reach. Feel it through that leg. Last one. Bring it all the way back in. Stand up for a second. Lean the hips forward. Shoulders come back. Hips can come towards that bar. Then let's take the other side. So bending into that right leg. Left leg comes forward. Solid point. Tapping forward. In. Out. In. Navel stays to spine. We keep it going. Out. Back. Bring it forward. Tapping with purpose. You got this. Good. Strong 
down through the left. Right knee pulls in, toes are left. We point as hard as we possibly can. Finding those shoulders back, we got four more. Keeping the chest open, reaching long. We're on our third round. We got two more full rounds left. Tap, tap. Last one forward, tap, out, tap, back, tap, and stand up. We're gonna walk the feet back, draw the shoulders forward, leaning the hips back, find that nice flat line with the spine. Hips level to the crown of the head, big breath in. Lean back, big exhale, take a little lower. All right, you guys ready for this next part? <laughs> so we're gonna find our band and we're gonna come back to the bar. So believe it or not, that was a warm up for what we're going to do. So we're gonna take our band at the bar and we're gonna have this band um, underneath the foot. So with our left hand on the bar, stand nice and close again, that bar is super close towards you. That band is gonna come underneath your inside foot. Your right hand or outside hand will grab that band and you're gonna stand all the way up. Right leg comes out to the side, soft bend in that left leg. We're gonna push that leg out as far as we can and then pull in, squeeze back up. So to modify, we go down a little and lift up. To take it deeper, more challenging, we come as low as we can and pull. So let's take this nice and slow, out and pull. Out for two. In for two. You got it. Out for two. In for two. Woo. If you don't have a band at home, maybe you're using a sock to push that outside leg out. Maybe you're using a towel to use as a slider. Let's take it a little faster for our last eight. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four, three, two, one. Pull it all the way in. Keep that band on the hand. We're gonna bring that leg behind us and bring it back. Soft bend in that left leg. Lower down slow and lift, snap back up. So that leg comes behind and lift up. Back and up. Slow for two, single coming up. Good, slow for two, single up, four, three, two, we got our singles coming up, one, eight, seven, six, five, you got it, four, three, two, one, pull it up, release that band. So now that band is gonna come around the ankle. Ooh. So with this band right around the ankles, you're gonna come into your center and squat, coming back into your chair. So leaning back into those heels once again. Again, not being too far away from our bar. All we're gonna do, bring that leg out and pull it back in without releasing that tension on the band. Step that foot up. Pull it in, out, in. So grounding down through that left leg, push out and in. So it's really easy to lean into that leg. We wanna stay where we're at and pull it out, in. Soften the shoulders, three, two, one. Let's take doubles, out, out, pull it back in. Out, out, pull it back in. So if you don't have a bar, out, out, pull it back. Four, three, control that coming in. Two, last one, pull it back. We're gonna take 45, foot comes back, pull in. 45 and in, 45 and in. We got four, three, Two, one, take that foot back, tap back, bring it back, seven, six, five, 
four, three, two, one. Bring it back in. Squat, lean back, take a nice stretch. Again, maybe this is a forward fold. We got the other side. Woo. Big breath in. Big exhale. All right. So taking that other side just for this, or actually, we're going to take this to the thighs. Other side's going to wait for a second. So taking the strap all the way up to the thighs. Again, to modify, you can take this band off. I'm not going to do it, but please feel free to push yourself. You're going to come over to your bar. Again, it's going to be nice and close towards you. And right here, you're going to take a nice little curtsy. So that right leg is going to circle behind you. Sink back into that curtsy squat. So we're going to squat. Leg comes out to the side. Squat. Side. Squat. Side. We got eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. We're going to hold that curtsy. One. Hold it right here if you have that band. You've got this. Push it out, 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 out. Option arm in front. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. We're going to bring it all the way up. Leg out to the side. Start to lean onto your bar. Leaning at a 45 with your body. Turn the toes out to the side. Soft bend in that leg. So we're going to lift up, down. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Keep that leg down. So as if we had four levels, we're going to kick, flex that foot. One, two, a little higher. Three, four. Again, if you have that band, I'm sorry. Bring it down. Three, two, one. Start over. Two, three, four, three, two, one. One, let's get three more rounds. Lift that leg. You got it. Keep it going. We're on our last round. Last one. Three, two, one. And bring it back in. You ready for the next side? <laughs> so again, we're going to start from the very beginning. We're going to bring our band. We're going to do our right hand on our bar. This band is going to come on that same foot that our hand is, taking it in the opposite hand. Pull up nice and tall. Leg is going to come out to the side, soft bend in that right leg. Again, we come down as low as we want to, and we pull back up. Coming down, snap back up. So it's down for two, up, down, for two, up, chest stays open. Let's do eight, seven, out for two, six, five, four, three. We got two, and we got singles. One, pull up, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. Keep that hand on your band. That foot comes behind you. We're going to come down. Hips are level to the head. Snap back. Oh my goodness. Seven, six, five. Let's flex that foot because it's pretty. Two. One. We're going to release that band. Again, this band is going to come around your ankles. Option if you do not want them to. With that band around the ankles, you're going to come back to your bar. And coming back to your bar, sink into that nice little chair. Get closer if you need to. Again, that leg steps out for one. Pull it back. Out. Back. We're rooting down through that right leg. Sinking deep. Sometimes I like to bring my hand to my hip for stability and support. Three, 
two, one. Step out for two, one, two, and bring it back. Whew. One, two, bring it back. We got six more. One, two, bring it back. Bring it in. Four, three, two, one. Take that 45, bring it back, tap it in. Back and in, back, in. Four, three, two, one. Bring that foot straight back, tap back, pull it in. Back and in. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it back again. This strap is gonna come either to your thighs or take it off, up to you. Grounding down through that right leg. My left leg's gonna come out to the side. Whew. All right, taking a second for myself. So with that left leg out to the side, we got curtsies. Left leg comes behind, squatting down, and bring it to the side. Option for arm in front, bring it to the side. Front, maybe you make this a little your own. Squat to the side. If you want this harder and you have that band, you can lift that leg as it comes to the side. Squat, up, squat, up. Four, three, two, one. Keep that curtsy, let's bring it down right here. If you have that band, open, open, open. We got six, four, Two, one, bring it all the way back. That leg comes to the side, right elbow comes down, soft bend in that right leg. Toes turn towards that bar a little bit. Angle to a 45, right here. And we're gonna lift, lower, lift, lower. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, four levels, flex that foot, kick one, two, three, four, three, two, one, two, three, four, three, two, one. Got four more. Up, up, down. Three more. We got it here. Take it slow. Bring it back. Last round, right after this, bring it up, Woo. down, 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 good, bring it all the way back in, arms come up, nice big stretch, and relax it down. All right, so now that we got that out of the way, we went from the feet to the ankles to the thighs, let's take this onto our mat. So grab your mat if you have a carpet at home, Feel free to use that carpet. And you will need your band for this. Again, only an option. Band is your choice. So here we're gonna come onto our mat and we're gonna come into a bridge. Bringing that band right above the knees. Again, don't be deterred if your band starts to roll on you. It is totally okay. Locking the heels in towards the sit bones. I like to grab my mat with my hands. Knees are hip width distance apart when I look down. Leaning into the heels, we lift up, lower down. We lift up and lower. So maybe you lift curving the tailbone and you don't lift a lot. Or maybe you lift all the way up. I'd encourage you to take that smaller lift and lower. Lift, lower. Keeping a little bit of resistance, allowing the knees to push out. We got three. Before we take halves, two, one, stay up, pulse up, 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 you got it. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, come up. You're gonna take your arms out to the side, lower down. Inhale, come up, take those arms up, exhale, lower down. 
So arms come up, hips lift up, exhale down. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lower down. Taking the hands all the way to that strap. Again, we're going to work that strap right to our ankles. And again, if your strap will roll, this is an opportunity to straighten it out. So with that strap around the ankles, just a little bit lower, flex the feet up. Hands are going to stay on your mat. Square up just a little bit more. Hands are going to stay on your mat. You're going to keep your left leg exactly where it's at, but you're going to pull your right leg out. So left leg, if you can see in this mirror behind me, left leg stays, right leg pulls, comes back, pulls, and back. Woo! Okay. This is a different level for us. I'm feeling this. Very quickly, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's pull those knees in. Give yourself a little hug for just a second, and then we're going to take that other side. Give yourself a nice little squeeze, wiggle out through the tailbone, maybe through the hips. Let's take those legs back up. We're so close to the end, guys. Right leg's gonna stay where it's at. Again, if you look into the mirror behind me, left leg pulls out and squeezes back in. Pulls out, in, out, in. We got eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Give your knees a squeeze. We're gonna come back to that bridge. So placing your feet down when you're ready. Feet ground down, heels ground down, we lift up. Lifting up with that bridge, hands can come down. We're gonna walk our feet out for two. So right leg first, we're gonna walk out, out, in, in. If you want to do toes, so placing your feet down on your mat, walk the heels in towards your seat. You're gonna come back to that bridge. So we're in a bridge. Why is it so hard? So grabbing on the ends of our mat, we're going to ground them through our heels, lift back up, and we're going to walk our feet out for two. So starting with that right leg, come up onto your toe, shift your weight into your left foot. We're going to step out, out, in, in. And that's all we're going to do. Again, if this is too much, you can take that band off. I say push through, maybe do singles. Let's do four more. Out, out, in, in. Try to keep those hips lifted. We got three more. We got two more, and last one. Come back to that bridge, take those hips up, drop that right hip, drop the left. Take a moment to find that gentle stretch, and then we're gonna come all the way back up. So again, hands ground down, we lift the left heel up. We come out, out, in, in. Out, out, in, in. Trying to keep that right knee pulled in. Try to keep those hips up. You can see that they can drop pretty quickly. Four more. Three more. You got it. Last two. Last one. Lower all the way down. Give yourself a nice little squeeze. Take that band off. Grounding down through that left foot. That right ankle is going to come up over that left knee. Figure four. So creating a nice little diamond with the leg. Allow that knee to push forward, opening up the hip. If you'd like to take this deeper, you can interlace the hands. Heel is level to the knee with that left leg. Let's swap it out. Releasing that right leg down. Left ankle comes on top of that right knee. You can push that left knee forward. And again, maybe you stay here. Maybe you find that deeper stretch, bringing the knees in, flexing that foot. Take a nice big breath in. And let it go. Starting to bring the knees in, rock and roll to come all the way up. Let's take our legs out to a nice wide straddle. Walking the hands forward, those feet flex. Nice flat back, just lean forward, bringing the chest forward and hips back. With a nice flat back, you'll get a stretch through the inner thighs as well as throughout the back and the glutes. When we round the back, um, we shorten the muscles. And when we lengthen, and flatten the back, we lengthen out the muscles, if that makes sense. Bend the arms, take it a little bit deeper. 
Maybe you walk your hands forward and let's bring it all the way back in. All right, guys, so that was your 30 minute bar class here at Yoga Fever. Um, if you haven't come to see us in person, come and see us. If you are just connecting with us online, thank you so much for joining. Thank you for allowing us to be a part of your practice. My name is Brittany and we'll see you next time.